Welcome back everybody. We're here today. We are going to be changing this front bumper. So it's going to go from this to this. So stay tuned. a quick preview of what it's going to look like. Let's get started. So we're going to pull the front, bolt, uh, front bolts off. Um, very simple to do this here. Um, I do recommend you disconnect the battery for this so uh, just in case your airbag goes and tries to deploy because there are sensors on the front. Um, but this is all your choice as far as what you decide to do. That's my recommendation. So we got four bolts on the top. Um, they're going to torque fit. We got two more on the bottom. This whole bumper comes right off. As you can see, it's just these two bolts. This one here was the one I was in the process of removing and I snapped the half inch adapter. And then I got this one down below here, already out. I still got this one here, but I can't really do anything until I get that adapter. So, I gotta finish painting some of this front on the sway bar and start finishing some of this up. You can still see some yellow down there. But I also gotta adjust these lights. So driving around last night, you got all the bugs and so we gotta make an adjustment to that. So I'll probably do that here in a little bit while I'm waiting for Xander. Okay, we got the half inch adapter. Got it broke free. We're ready to kick this bad boy off. Hey, you don't wanna have any fun? Come on, kick it, kick it. Oh, he got flip flops on. He's a sissy when he kicks. Man, those are rusted. Okay, so we got the bumper off. Frame's a little more rotted up here than we thought. Uh, but for right now, we are just going to paint it up to help kind of slow it down. We did use the wire brush on it. Um, we did paint it up too, so we're just waiting for the bumper now. Um, the bumper does show out for delivery by UPS, so as soon as they get here, we will open it up and get this mounted. Okay, like this video, we got the front bumper mounted. Um, it was a little difficult getting behind this piece here. Um, but same uh, same concept. I had the two bolts on each, either side, plus the one bolt on below. Um, I kind of walk. I'll give you a walk through here in a second, and you can see the towards the end of the video. Um, if you guys have any questions, leave them in the comments below. Also, check out our merch store down below in the comments. Um, this is one of the Overland shirts that we have for Airsman Performance. Um, we also have other shirts on there as well. Um, so hopefully you guys like this video. Um, if you guys are new to the channel, subscribe. Make sure you hit that notification bell so you guys get up-to-date information when we post. And we'll see you guys next time. Stay tuned for the winch that we're going to be installing later on this week. And then we also have a video that we're building up for my wife's Jeep over here. Um, for the three-core radiator that we're upgrading to help cool hers down a little bit better. So, see you later.